Ooh, a Zelda Ocarina yeah. of Time right here. Oh, man. Is it in there? Yeah, it's in there. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. dun, dun. And this is a repro case, by the way. Yeah, you never see this one. Goosebumps, read review readers. You're in for a scare. Pretty good, look at this. Some hats, Ooh. some Space Jam, some Pulp Fiction. What'd you say you said you saw? Right There's Zorro, but I thought you saw Zorro and another one. Zorro okay. and Armageddon, that one's cool. But look at this, sealed. Yeah. Okay. Next Friday cards. You know, if you're gonna pull out cards at the club, at the party, this is the one to pull it with. Are you getting Armageddon? Or is this gonna be a joke? Thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring today's video. No, I just, oh, that's <laughs> <laughs> Ricky, did you ever watch the Osbournes? No. Me neither. This was never my speed. Were you, are you even an Aussie guy at all? No, I'm not. Not at all? No, not at all. None I mean, I'm a Bla Black Sabbath era, but that's it. Okay. And like, other than that, I was like, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll leave it to Gabo. Something is not right here. That's... Him and Gabo kind of talk alike. Ricky, just abide in Christ, dude. Okay. Chris, I found this vintage single stitch Converse shirt, but the back reminded me of you. Look at the back. Look at what it says in the back. Yeah, yeah, show everybody what it says. Deep in the hole, dude. I Just love being deep in the hole. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> so I actually have an NES banger with me that I'm gonna hold surprise and hold hostage for a little bit because I don't want to show everybody too early. I brought one, Ricky. A banger. Ooh. I can't wait. To Guess see right now which one it is for the set. Uh, bonks. Okay, I'm not gonna tell you. You'll see in a little bit. Oh, I know what it is. What? Does this have to do with Jared? Nope. Oh, dang. Okay, I don't know what it is then. Ricky, this takes me back Which to one? your old bedroom watching South Park. You know what my favorite episode we watched together was? Scuzzlebutt. Scuzzlebutt, that's exactly what I was gonna say. I, I missed that. <laughs> 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 this was good, good era right here, man. Also, I was looking at this, a little bit of a heavy metal 2000 fig. I just remember being a kid and walking by like the VHS rentals and seeing heavy metal 2000 stuff and being like, whoa, mom Seriously. wouldn't let me watch that. Oh, and look what Ricky's looking at Ooh. over here. There you go, some at back, some nice. poor. Uh, nice. Oh. Okay. Mommy? Summers? Curtis! Summers. Curtis, yes. Oh, oh whoa, Rick. Hey, Rick. Yep. Oh. oh, what the heck? <laughs> so I got this really sick shirt. It actually says it's a 2X. There's no way this is a 2X. I just like the color. Ricky, you won't believe what two NES games we didn't have this deep in the set. First, we have Battle Chess. This is a Data East game that, funny enough, is probably one of the most garbage games in the world, but ask my brothers who are on the podcast, played this endlessly. Secondly, possibly one of the most quoted things for me and my brothers is Kung Fu Heroes by Culture Brain. Go up to my brothers anytime and say, atoo, atoo. that is this game. It's a top-down, very weird, interesting style gameplay. The punches are almost like you stand still and like it scoots you forward versus like your arm extending. A little puzzly, super fun, super worth playing, and still super cheap. I gotta see where we're at now. They have these two and this shirt. And Ricky got a shirt too in there that he didn't pull out and he left in a black trash bag and didn't want to show the audience because he doesn't like you guys. <gasps> you can just pull it out right now. Okay. When in doubt, whip it out, as they say. You know, that's my motto in life. There you go, Ricky got this shirt. Invader Zim. Very nice. Not a bad deal either. Let's see where we're at in the set. All right, let's see together. These games put us at, da, 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 drum roll, drum roll, 700 and freaking 37 NES games in our set. Ricky, we have 737 Nintendo games. They haven't even seen, oh, never mind. Ricky, don't try to give them sneak peeks of what I have in here, okay? I'm so sorry. So we go to one of our friend's booths that I see all the time, and I see something that you feel like I would have seen a million times, but I haven't. Yo! So they have the Halo 5 oh, like Xbox with what the controllers the? and the Australian, the different the power region. Edition? Yeah, you never see this one. I didn't get to open it up yet. I kind of want to check it out. He Dude, wanted 100 cool. for this, just so you know. That's yeah. Tough. It's like, they sell for like 150 bucks. They do? And he wanted 100 for this, but the console only sells for 100 bucks. I like how I'm whispering, even though he's right there and knows, oh, that's a nice belt, Ricky. You're looking nice and spicy. You know what you're looking, you know, ice spice? Your brown rice spice. What? I don't know. Ricky! And right there on the table is a Super Nintendo Mini, a classic. 
If you think that Super Nintendo Mini is cool, we're always selling super cool and unique and random and rare items on Whatnot. And tonight, we're selling more goodies. You know we're gonna be doing a giveaway. Now this is important if you want 15 bucks of free spending. Make sure to download Whatnot using my link in the description box below for 15 bucks off to spend on my show or shop on any show really anywhere on the app. Now again, there is a show tonight and there's a show every Thursday. We're always here, we've been on Whatnot for like three years solid. See you there, let's have some fun, do a giveaway, have a good time. Thanks again, Whatnot. But of all the time that we've been out here doing this, I've never seen the PAL version of this. So to see the PAL version and all the games listed on the back and the unique art style again unique to us because we never see that one it was something i had to make an offer on man i'm still thinking about this ricky look 20 plus one games installed i just never see it and everything's in there two controllers i feel like the artwork's a little different look at star fox there by the way oh yeah so derpy that it's good such a oh here we go look at what it starts out with too contra 3. twisted has been shaking that little pony for a while now dang you found the box for the switch all right here you go man thank you sir i appreciate you mushy mushy and thank you May Mugai will be with you. I don't even know what that means. Ricky, anything else? And with that, I got it for 80 bucks. These things are worth like 150. I'm debating if I'm gonna keep this or not. It's just such a cool, unique item. How'd you guy it? Guy it, buy it. Ricky, learn how to talk, dude. You had to guy it. Why are you making fun of me? <laughs> Sorry. How much of the books, Anna, for all the goosebumps? Oh, God, this one's hard. Uh, maybe? Toto, por todo. Ricky, por todo over here. Por todo? Por todo. Goosebumps, reader beware. You're in for a scare. Do, 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 do. Ooh, those are good. Those are good ones. Those are fun. Okay, give me 30 for all. Okay, why not? I don't know how this is here and looking that cool. This is a, what year did you say? Right here, look in the back. 1989. 1989. And it looks, it looks like a, like a legit It looks pretty costume, good. Because it has all the other parts right here as I well. I would put it on, but I, that means I have to buy it. Yeah, I don't want to mess with it, so. That thing's really cool, dude. Gorsh, gorsh. Basele, basele, basele. <laughs> yeah, they like it. What is Curtis doing over there? Like, I just realized, look at it, literally, what the heck? He, he didn't know we were filming. What? This is a weird thing happening right now. What's he, what is he? What is going on right now? Yo! Have a look. What in the world? It's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. It has the controllers underneath too. Both of them. Are those yours? Both of them? Yeah, super clean. Clean. Same, that's what we were just saying, yep. Dude, look at this. I was surprised at that deal. Here, Rick, you hold some, that's you show some. That's a great lot. 30 bucks for all these? Anna, what a great deal. That's our friend Anna. All these old ghost pumps, this is the newer ones, the Fear Street stuff. But look at this, you have all the classics and 30 bucks. These actually hold decent value. Oh, I'll be honest. I think Ricky sold his for like around 130 bucks. I might have to keep I a did. couple of these for display, especially because we got spooky season coming right around the corner. Dude, they are pretty sick. Yeah, I would love to have some of these kind of set up on the podcast studio. I think that's where we're gonna, Curtis is saying no behind the camera, dude. <laughs> You're off the podcast. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> he, he's partial owner, dang it. <laughs> Ricky. Yo. We worked there together for years. Did you really? Yeah. My brother did too. My brother did the one apart. Woo! Yeah, they, they used to, this kind of stuff, if you'd be there for a while, they'd give this stuff away. Those are, that's this a cool one. This is a sick one, dude. One, dude. That's a beautiful. Let me see what the front looks like. Real quick. Any front hit? Probably just has it. No, nothing. Oh, no? wow. No one out in the front. That's weird. Dang. This thing still appears. Had this for a while. This is like a some video game console controller. I don't know what console it was. I can't remember. CDI. CDI, I think. But it's not as cool looking as I, I'm not feeling that. I just am not. So we get wind as we're at the swap meet that our buddy Brian is like, hey, there's some stuff at my car. Apparently Brian has like games oh, yeah. for us and he just said, meet us at our car. So we're walking to his car right now to see if potentially there's a... We hope, we, we hope we're going the right way. I don't, I don't know loading if this is the right way. Loading zone, hopefully this is a loading zone. Okay, so apparently it might be boxed N64 stuff, which would be awesome. So let's go see. I see him down there now. We finally spotted him. So let's cross our fingers, Ricky, that uh, it's going to be something crossed. good. 
Fingers crossed. Cross hey, baby. Ooh, so what's in there, Brian? I don't know. This is empty. I need a, oh. I need a, I need a It's empty. To ship. I was all excited. I was like, all right, yes, what's in the box? I would have been, I would have been laughing if you just, if you just opened like, dude, check it out. There's nothing. Like, dang. <laughs> That's what I brought you guys. Uh, let's see. Are the games in the, ooh, okay. Game Boy? Let's pull it over here, Ricky. Let's get it on top of this. Let's go over in this area. All right, come on in here, Twister. Let's see what it is. We got Game Boy Colors. We got more Game Boy Colors. And I'll open that up. Why don't you start pulling those out, Ricky? Ooh, I can't even reach in there. Then we find out it's N64 stuff. So do we go to his car, we pull out the box, and right there, it's a couple of the games that are kind of one of the, the ones you want to see. We're talking Mario 64 and Ocarina of Time. Yo, listen up. We will not live in a two-dimensional world. We won't go in one direction or see where we can zap. We will walk through walls. We will take a look around us. We will not be confined. What, Zelda Ocarina yep. of Time right here? And then Space Jam something. Mario 64, Jet Force Gemini, so good. Yeah. Okay, and then some other sealed. So what do you want uh, What do we want to buy, Ricky? Get whatever you want, dog. What do you think? How much are is the uh, how much for the bundle? Do you know if the N64s were? Yeah, they're part of this. They actually, one of them came with all these. Yeah. Oh wow! Okay. So one's complete. It has the controller and everything. Yeah. Okay, one has like one, the controller and everything. One is just like uh, the power. Okay, sweet. All right, Ricky, what do we want? I think I want these coins. Oh baby, we got some Game Gear games too in here. Yeah, Tasmania, the classic. Like Game Gear there, but... Smash TV, let's go! Yes. Now that's a fun game. My son was playing Smash TV the other day and uh, loving it, actually. Genuinely loving the game, so. Uh, yeah, I mean, how much for a couple on 64s and? So the complete one, I was gonna do like 75. Okay. And then the other one, 50 bucks. Okay. It's, it's the power and the console. What about, what are you thinking on this stuff? So, I was doing like 80, 80. Mm -hmm. I'll do 30 for that one. Okay. These two for 80. What about these guys? The speaker as well. Oh, is it? They work and all that, but and, uh, that was fine. Okay. All right, here we go. This is a good idea. 80, 80. Ricky and I will each take one. There's only one way to find out, Ricky. After looking for a while, Ricky and I decide, okay, we each kind of want one of these. And the best way to figure this out is for me to straight up hold these behind my back and see, see who, who, what Ricky's going to pick. If he picks right hand, he gets a certain game, left hand a certain game. Let's let him pick behind the back. All right, ready? All right, Ricky, you can't look. We each want one. They're 80 each. Ricky, it's uh... right, my right hand or my left hand? Your left hand. Left hand. You got yourself Ocarina, Ocarina. Ocarina. Oc See, that's the one I wanted. Okay. I'll I'm just it. kidding. <laughs> that's how it is. And I got Mario 60 Horror, my favorite game. <laughs> and with that, we're happy. Three boxed N64 games. See, now this deal is one of those deals where you gotta know people. You don't know people, you're not gonna get any good deals. Well, on a day like today where we wouldn't have got that without knowing Brian. All right, Ricky. There's only one way to pass you these games. Ricky, there is so much at stake right now. What? <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Here's our box copy. <laughs> I'm so sorry, internet. Sometimes we, we need things to do. Ricky, you better catch Dude, this. Dude, ca what if I don't catch it? A CIV Ocarina of Time. <laughs> what are you doing? Please catch this, Ricky. Oh, oh. he got it! <laughs> Woo! All right, next one. Mario 64. You might want to put Zelda down. Don't put it on the grass, people get mad at us. <laughs> I'm out of breath, by the way, which is interesting because I do this Terramaster all the time for like 45 minutes at full speed. I didn't Here we go. I didn't Mario like 64. That. Dude, Mother Mario, be with us. Yes! He did it. He did it. He really, really did it. He's Ricky. He's sticky. You gotta see the special edition Halo. Oh, and see. What the? <laughs> you go, Ricky. I don't know anything about these. You can take them. Ooh. There's Mimikyu something and a couple of pokies. Question is, which, which is the top? Uh, what, the Johnson? I'm gonna call this the top. Yep. And there you go. Here, you can take these too. I don't know anything about them. Item number 45, 272, Kobe. Did you see the bottom? Did you already ask him? Nope, not a word. Oh shoot. Ricky, we've officially reached uh, swap meet level hunting. You know, everyone, I mean, come on, five bucks. I mean, every you time I go to the no. store, I'm paying 20 bucks for these. Seriously. So I'll take it. And then you ended up picking up that uh, Pikachu stuff, and not Pikachu, I love how they call it Pikachu. I can Pokemon I stuff. Can Pokemon stuff. Hopefully those are cool for you. I don't know, I just grabbed you a stack, man. I think the come up though is definitely the extension cords. Oh yeah. So Ricky. Yeah. I had Gabo when he was at a convention recently. Yeah. He sent me a picture of a game. 
and I actually have been wanting this game for a while. This game is called Copper Jacket by Monsoon Studios. So this is a homebrew. It's actually a lot like, the most comparable game I would say, yeah. it's a lot like Akari Warriors. Oh, that's cool. Super good soundtrack, super unique. Only came out just a few years ago. I think they even had a Kickstarter for it, but it's just a beautiful throwback to this style. I mean, I just love the way this, look at this girl's face up close too, by the way. So, wonderful game. I saw John Riggs talk about it like two years ago yeah. when the game was first about to be out. When I saw it, it was one of those things in the words of Billy where I'm like, I knew I had to I have it. And it's one to two players. So, you know, when you think you can play with a, a friend, it, it's a one up. Oh. I, I love that they kept the, the back original Nintendo like so cheesy. I yeah, love it. It was great. There's a one wheel over there. Should I try it? <laughs> okay. That game put this at 738. Man, the only thing bad about this, Ricky, is I genuinely want to play this and it's sealed, so I have to open it. I mean, that's okay. Okay. But, Ricky, yo. did you do these as a kid? The egg coloring dips and stuff? Oh yeah. You did, okay. Yeah. That's awesome. I, was, I mean, I'm just gonna say what I was gonna say. Yeah, you I thought it. it was like a white family thing. I really did, I, I'm being honest. No, I'm being no, honest. Yeah, you should do it. The, okay, so there's that one, but there's also, what else we got? Noggins, yes. Yo. Oh, this is the whole Easter egg set right here, my boy. This is, they were excited. Oh, the Goodyear blender. Oh, you need that. What, the Johnson? Yo, it's a cologne, I think. That's actually awesome. Yeah. Actually Civil awesome. War. Let me see what it smells like. Smoke it. Smell it. Whoa, this is like like dad, dad cologne. I like it. That's like what I'm wearing right now. I'm wearing literally dad cologne right now. My, my, dad, my dad bought me his old cologne. Wild Musk or something? What is it, Ricky? What is it? Surf BA. That's stuff. Actually, sick. It's kind of cool. It's so beat too, which makes it so cool. Dude, I wish it didn't have this though. That's the only kind of stains yeah. I don't like on a shirt. That's true. Oh, what's behind it though? Uh, PS1. Oh, sick. Oh, PS1 it. group. Don't drink it. It's the worst water on earth. It's the worst. It really is the worst water on earth. It's which one? Arrowhead. Arrowhead, dude. Yeah, it, it tastes. Dude, it tastes like it's out of the earth. Tastes like lead, absolutely. Ricky, do you see this truck over here? Oh. Let's see it. Dude. I don't know. All right, let's see it. <laughs> I got a bunch from Ray. Right? Pass it, Dust Ball. Oh, man. Is it in there? Yeah, it's in there. All right. Oh, it's it's so light in my hand. Uh, let me look. Let me look. I heard the disc. Tested it and working, right? I heard the disc. Oh, yeah, working great. Okay, cool, cool. He said he tested it for us, dude. Don't oh. worry. Oh. Yeah, Dusty always tests. So we can tell the whatnot piece. Yeah, dude. Zelda. Oh, dang it. It's clean, though. Let's see. Oh, Is the controller in there? Sorry. No, it's all good. Okay. Well, Ricky gets first dibs because to be he yelled it to Ricky. Yeah. The controller's there, just closed your eyes. Oh, okay. Oh, it's in there. Yeah. I feel it. Yeah. Ricky gets dibs because he technically yelled, hey, Ricky, do you need this? Huh? Can you split it? Okay, good. Sure. So it's a good model. It's a good model. Oh, it's a good oh. model. If you guys didn't know, this is the one that was developed by Capcom. I think it was like 1974. <laughs> Idiot. Okay, Super Power Blade 2 is my favorite NES game. <laughs> Still what is this? <laughs> oh, it's got the worm straight yeah, up. Oh, heck yeah. That's the, that's the good good. That's awesome. Nice Dusty, 100 bucks on the GameCube. Oh my God, dude. No, you owe me 120, bro. Don't cry today. What'd I do? Yeah. Dusty, Ricky, and I have been splitting everything lately, so here's from both of us. Oh, my God. From us to you. At paid asking price. 120 oh, bucks. Yeah. See, we do good things once in a while, too. Wow. That just means he has to hook it up next it's time. So tight, <laughs> All right, so he just walked up and asked what oh, nationality man, I am. <laughs> Come on, bro. Come on, Jay. So, so I, I did an, a test, a DNA test. What do you think it came back as? Guess how much Mexican I have in me? Want some more? 40%. <laughs> oh, yo, yo. Zero percent Mexican in me. And I thought I, ha I thought I was. So the majority was German, secondly was Spanish, Spain. Oh, okay. So yeah, Spain and Germany, for all those who keep asking. But I still I identify as Mexican when I'm at the Swami. <laughs> it's true, especially when he's next to me. Gotta get the deals here somehow. <laughs> I thought he looked beaner than me. Crazy! I feel like we have to give him just a proper, all right, let's 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 give a proper, real shout out, because I kind of actually like you guys. What is your actual oh, channel name? The Camel Crew straight on up, YouTube. Straight up The Camel Crew. Straight up, yeah. Why should they subscribe to, the, to your channel? Spoofs, spoofs. Yeah. Spoofs, spoofs. You get to see the behind the scenes of what Riff and the boys don't get and what we score. <laughs> we don't leave anything left. <laughs> let's let's be real. <laughs> what is this? Oh, oh, oh let's go! Oh, 
I, 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 I haven't showed the audience yet who is using this. Everybody guess in the comments who would be using a lowrider toy. Dude, this is a great toy. <laughs> Say what you want. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Sheesh. <laughs> random Xbox, like at a random DVD holder over here. Um, yeah, I don't see anything. The Grand Theft Auto 3 might be part of a collection one. Oh yeah, it is, the Xbox collection, wherever it is, right down there, yeah. Ricky is always looking at random tools, look. Right there. I know, I'm like, dude, I actually need a good He's jack. He's into it. He's into it. The only problem is I don't think it's working. Ricky, you ever see this movie? Go down? No. Evil Bong and Evil Bong King Bong. <laughs> Wait, what? I've seen both of these. They're legit hilarious and it's so stupid. They are so stupid. Look who it is. <laughs> They're perfect sea <laughs> horror oh, my movies. Bad. All right, Ricky, earlier I teased that I had a big NES game hiding. I, I wouldn't say how big, it's it's bigger. Which okay. one do you think it is? You haven't guessed yet. Everybody can guess. All right, so Curtis, it's a big boy. Curtis, you guess too. What NES game am I hiding under here? All right, uh, Super Power Blade 2. Oh, yep, that's it. Panic Restaurant. Okay, what do you think? I'm hiding an NES game that's like, oh, maybe a hundred, hundred fifty dollar game. Oh. oh, well now that you say that. Yeah. Um, the tennis one. How many are there? And you guys are good at building suspense. All right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I can't just find, I don't know games like that. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. And this is a repro case, by the way. Oh. But the Jetsons Cog Wells Caper. Oh shoot, I didn't even realize I had the manual. This is like $250 then. So, I have to be clear. This came from a friend of ours named Badback. By the way, we're doing a trade for it. Uh, we don't even know what we're trading yet, but he <laughs> knew we needed this, so he got us this. Man, I, didn't, I forgot if the manual was in here. This is expensive. Dude. So, heck yeah. If you're looking for a little bit of a hidden gem, you gotta pick up Jetsons on the NES. Of all the more expensive games on the NES, you hear a lot of people talk about games like, I don't know, Dinosaur Peak, you hear about games like Felix the Cat, Chippendales 2, some of these colorful, more expensive, but still really good games. A Taito game that you gotta play is Jetsons. It's so vibrant, it's so colorful. It's one of those video games that's so visually pleasing to look at. And I must say, if you're gonna play it and you haven't played the Super Nintendo one, get that one as well. I probably like the Super Nintendo one a little bit more because of the mechanics with the buster or the guster or the vacuum, however, whatever you wanna call it. It's not the poltergust. Super fun, it's totally worth picking up. And this is one of those games that I'm so excited to have in the collection because not only is it a heater, but it's a good heater. So Ricky, we gotta add that one to the set. <laughs> Meet George Jetson, <laughs> his boy Alroy. <laughs> what a good show Jetsons was. We need to bring back some Jetsons love. I was watching actually the other day with my wife. She liked it. She's never with even seen Chanel, it. With Chanel, your wife. With Chanel, my wife. With Chanel, the MILF. Oh, whatever. That dog's a big dog. Oh. Go ahead, Ricky. I don't think you've crossed one off yet, Ricky. <laughs> Ricky, I was wrong too. Look at this. I was wrong, dude. Jetson's Cogwell's Caper, 225 loose. What? I did not realize that. I was wrong. And we have the manual for it too. Shima Monino, adding it to the list. Uh, yep, nope, yes, we'll put it as loose now and I'll adjust it later. This puts us, Ricky, at, ready? 739. We need one more. Ricky, what's happening over there? You know I'm filming you. You're filming me again? What'd you just buy? Bought these for Nicole. She really likes the, you know, the caramel things. They're like, they're like little wafer things. Wait, let of. me find the, the ones that I hate. This is like the Mexican candies, right? What yeah. are, oh, these, dude. These are the worst. What? These. These. Duvalin? These. Let's give it. These things. Oh yeah, it, it's, a, it's an oh, acquired dude, taste. dude, I cannot do it. <laughs> I cannot do it for anything. Now, Ricky, the the watermelon, spicy watermelon suckers, oh, now those so are good. next level. The mango good. ones were, were first. I They're do like the mango good. ones too, but I don't like the texture as much. The watermelon uh, ones are those fire. Yeah. Hey, Curtis found a Mario Plus. This is an older one too. A little roasty. It's yeah. a little roasty. I don't know, you can maybe put them in a light wash depending how light your washer is. What year is he from? That's a Kelly. Oh, a poor man's watch. 41. That's a Kelly one. Yeah, it's pretty big. No, that's Curtis's. No, man. Oh. oh. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> I 
FBI, open up. Hello? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let the door go, I'm gonna get smashed. <laughs> All right, apparently Curtis, apparently Curtis, Got Ricky and I a couple of games for the set from Ooh, when you were in Connecticut. When I went to, yeah, Retro World Expo, yeah, yeah. I went up there and I was like, you know, I don't know, I have problems buying for myself. So one thing that I don't have a problem with is buying for other people. And I was like, how do I contribute to the NES Pursuit? I like how the people on your camera get to see how dumb it looked with me, <laughs> with me trying to get yeah, the mic. Yeah, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> trying to get the mic to you. We'll, we'll... I didn't have a lot, you know, I didn't think it was going to be crazy, but I was like, you know what? How do I contribute on a budget? The money is not what matters, Curtis. It, it it's the games. It <laughs> right. So I got, for each of you, I guess it's three, but <gasps> Ooh, down to, all right. So I played this at Retro World, Spelunker. Spelunker, Whoa. all right, let me, let me, let me cross it off. Thank you, Curtis, you're such Curtis. a sweetheart, ready? Uh, Spelunker, Sp, Sp, you, we don't have, Curtis. Yeah. I had to coordinate with Ben the entire is that, time. Don't, don't let me, am I, see if my knowledge is good. Is that Broderbund? Who makes it? The, uh, the, who makes, who's the, the... Dude, action series. I'm just gonna do this broader button. <laughs> Let's go. Sometimes I feel good about my knowledge. Let's go, okay. So Thank that you, one, Thank you, you guys can split however you guys want. They're pretty I mean, they much the same. The next one was Rollerball. Rollerball, oh. okay, wait, wait. I might be wrong. Hi, H-A-I, developer? Uh, yeah. No Dang. way. Yep, that's pretty good. I'm actually I'm shocked, shocked right Look now. It. Look at that. Yes. What in the world? All right, all right, all right, hold on. Oh, you're, look at that right there. Rollerball. That was easy. Dang. And, was like, and then the last one was, it, it's because of the title's a little scuzzier, but, or not the title, but the cover. Oh, that yeah. is me. Look at, no. there was a misprint. Ooh. That's not $9 or $10. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Kurt. This isn't Venice. This is Borat's favorite. Come look. Ven nice, Beach. Venice. <laughs> That's awesome. Curtis, yeah, Curtis. Three, list, three eight. All right, let's put this in here. Let's here do it. Go. Let's I do like it. Venice Beach. Uh, Venice <laughs> Beach. <UV. laughs> for you. Wow. Three, three more games on the end. Let's go see how many we have now. Thank you, Curto. Curto. You got it. Thank you, bro. Ricky. Yeah. 742 <laughs> NES games in our set. We Thanks. have problems. Thanks to Curto. Thanks to Curto. <laughs> <laughs> If you don't sing in your car, I truly think you're a psychopath. I don't think I've ever seen Curtis actually put an, an original NES game and turn it on. Let me see. I want to see you try one minute. Of oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that to that game. Did you just mess up my label? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> nice and hard. There we go. Nope, that's that's not all the way. No, it is. It is. It, is. it wasn't in at all. You freaking guy. Let's hey, see. man. All right, we push start. Oh, yeah. Oh. How's that sound? <laughs> <laughs> How do you get go. through this? Let's start, baby. Packing factory. Curtis likes the butt pack. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, come on, come on. How are you feeling, Mr. J? Look at them graphics, though. All right, we just slide it all. We just slide it all. Is that what we're doing? It's like Chippendale Rescue Rangers. You can grab them and throw them. Hit that lever, bro. Starter switch. Yeah, baby. You and I both always talk about Papa Meat, how we like the channel. Yeah, yeah. Look at this. Literally, just now, look what he just put out. Welcome back to the Papa Meat channel. How you doing? How you doing? A book about original Goosebumps book. Dude, and you just bought them. I just bought a bunch <laughs> today at the Swap Dude, Meet. If you guys haven't uh, ever checked this stuff out, it's actually funny. It's probably one of the better channels on the internet right now, for sure. Yeah, unsubscribe from us. Okay. <laughs>
Gonna pause the video right here and talk about Squarespace for a moment. Thank you, Squarespace, a beautiful platform on which to create your website. How about Squarespace's online store? You can sell your products on their online store. Whether you sell physical, digital, or service products, Squarespace has the tools you need to start selling online. And how about their flexible payments? You can make checkout seamless for your customers with simple but powerful payment tools. Accept credit cards, PayPal, and Apple Pay. And you can offer customers the option to buy now and pay later with Afterpay and Clearpay. And as we always say, go to squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash pixel game squad to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain.